I got some awesome news for you guys. Now, this video is going to be uploaded on Diamonds Live News and the Diamonds Live Gaming channel. If you guys would like to subscribe to either one of those channels and you're unsure what I'm talking about, just click the freaking description and you'll see the channel. Subscribe to it. I love you guys a long time. All right, so the big news that I have for you guys today is that Sony has unveiled the brand new PlayStation 4. And you guys are like, PlayStation 4? Like, wh like, what are you talking about, Tom? Well, there's actually been multiple PlayStation 4s that Sony has been talking about today. One PlayStation was the PlayStation Slim. And of course, like, not too many changes there, right? You get the PlayStation Slim. It's a lot slimmer. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I'll give you my thoughts on the PlayStation Slim later in this video. But first, I want to talk about the brand new PlayStation 4 Pro. The PlayStation Pro allegedly is going to have... 4k resolution that means that we will be able to play 4k games on the playstation 4 pro now as of right now most pcs are having problems running 4k resolution so i gotta see how this is gonna work with my own eyes you know what i'm saying i mean hopefully it does work but we'll see now you will be able to play your old playstation 4 games on this system so don't worry about that you're not gonna have to go buy a brand new library of games or anything like that you don't have to worry about like oh my god i can't play gta 5. well you can now if you guys are wondering what 4k resolution looks like on the playstation 4 pro well here you go sony got us some examples of what it looks like you guys are checking it out there's gonna be a few games that will be upgraded to the playstation 4 pro and that is the brand new Tomb Raider game, the up and coming Spider-Man game, and Watch Dogs 2. You'll be able to play that at a higher resolution on the PlayStation 4. Now, if you want to display 4K resolution, of course, you're going to need a 4K monitor or television that can produce that. Now, that doesn't mean you can't get the PlayStation 4 Pro experience. If you don't have a 4K television, you still can get it. The game is going to look a lot better on the television that you have right now even if it's not 4k resolution it's going to look good but it's not going to be 4k the graphics will be improved but it's not going to be 4k the playstation pro will come with a upgraded cpu with a higher clock rate also a one terabyte hard drive so if you guys are having issues like saving games and such and if you buy all your games on the playstation store you might want to upgrade to this. Now, I'm not going to lie. I first purchased my PlayStation 4 at launch. So, of course, I had the lower tier hard drive. Now, I buy all my games from the PlayStation Store. I don't know why. I just buy them there, man. I, I don't like having this. I just love the ability of selecting different games on my hard drive and playing it. I just want to be a couch potato and play my games from my chair without having to get up and change to the 30 different games that I have. Like, I just want to click a button play right i ran out of space on my playstation so this is definitely going to be beneficial having a one terabyte hard drive so this is going to be awesome so basically with one terabyte you guys are going to be getting an additional hard drive that's pretty much what the basic playstation 4 is 500 gigabytes plus 500 gigabytes and that's what you guys get with one terabyte now remember i made a video about this a few months ago and people were like dom you're lying like what are you talking about this isn't even true but this is real news man this stuff came out today let's talk about the other playstation and i'm not too sure how to feel about this i don't know what sony was thinking because they also released a playstation slim now i'm not gonna lie this thing is freaking ugly like it's one of those girls that you do not want to be seen in public with like i kid you guys not since most of the playstation 4 is right the original playstation 4 is black i thought that sony should have took things in a different level and went with different color bases but guess what i'm predicting this right now this is what sony's gonna do and i love sony i've been a fan of sony since the playstation one sony's gonna pull that money grab and what they're gonna do is they're gonna come out with brand new playstation 4s that are gonna be all different types of colors that's what we're gonna do you're probably gonna see a gold playstation 4 a turquoise playstation 4 blue red pink orange green you're gonna see that coming very soon trust me Domus live just said it you guys gotta trust me on this one it's coming 
And I guarantee that's why they didn't give us a white PlayStation Slim. They decided to go with the old basic color. You guys let me know in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to go subscribe to the other channel, Diamonds Live Gaming, Diamonds Live News. We'll be in the description below, depending upon what channel you're watching it on. Of course, there's no reason to put Diamonds Live News in the description if you're watching it on Diamonds Live News. But there is a reason to put the Diamonds Live Gaming channel in the description if you're watching.